Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne. As I promised in the previous video, I brought a friend. Hello! Who are you, friend? I'm the captain. This is the captain. Uh, and you, have you ever played this game? Uh, only the, the couple of times we tried to make the first episode. Yeah, so everything from this point on is blind to him. He has seen what, we've, what I did in the previous video when we tried it multiple times, um, but we are ready to go. So we just healed, we just saved, we've learned the combat, let's uh, let's try and get out of the hospital as Hijiri told us to do. Spoilers, we're, I didn't know we are getting out of this hospital. Yes you did. No I didn't. Hijiri said get out of the hospital. I didn't, I, I had no idea. <laughs> okay, well. Maybe he never gets out. I mean, it shouldn't be that hard to get out of the hospital. We we can just go up to the lobby and run out. No, we can't. You cannot use this egg. Why not? Because apparently there's a whole bunch of rubble there now. Who put that rubble there? I don't know. They have a permit. The exit is just as you perceive it. Well, I'd expect so. Were you trying to leave the hospital? Yes. No. Then how about next door? This is the main building, but there's an annex. Maybe you can use that entrance. Yeah, I can punch through a window and jump through it. Uh, you'd think so. <laughs> I mean, you can punch most things. What? Class? Text, you say? I don't know anyone by that name. That's, uh, less than helpful. I need to find her. She stole my magazine. She did steal our magazine. Um, totally stole our magazine. Alrighty then. Uh, let's go this way. Everything's still safe. So, yeah. yeah. It's okay. That's great. Oh, I can't put them to do this. Oh, God. Oh, okay. yeah. Use the right stick. Sky. It's a little odd. Uh, it is a little odd. It actually doesn't really look like a sky, does it? Mm hmm. Sky could occasionally look like that. I don't think it can, actually. Sun's setting. But those don't look like clouds. More on that later. I don't know. I've seen some pretty weird clouds <laughs> before. The stairs look like stairs. The I stairs do look like stairs. Let's check the room, see if anything... Oh, hello. Oh, yeah. See you catch. Cash cue. Mm -hmm. you know, like you do. Medicine. That's helpful. Who keeps medicine in a floating cube? Apparently demons do. Oh, okay. Saw a human at the annex. He's probably dead by now. Eaten by a demon or something weird like that. Good to know. Yeah. I wonder if that's a uh, text. He said he was going to go to the annex. Yeah. He's probably dead. We should leave him. Aw. But he was our friend, and he was so stylish. Yeah, but now we're the stylish one. We got all those, like, you know, blue tattoos and stuff. <laughs> it's, it's pretty stylish. You know the security system at the passageway head? You need an annex key pass to get through. That's good to know. Do we have one of those? Yeah. Uh, this way. Let's see. Anything down this way? I see a cash cube! Cash cube! Two life stones. There's a life stone doing this. Life stone heals HP moderately. Woo! That's good. Don't need that right now. Because sometimes minor HP isn't enough. You need moderate HP. Well, yeah. True story. We're gonna skip that for a second. Let's check these two rooms. See if there's any other attached cubes in here or NPCs. Some demons called Pretas making a fuss about wanting Magatsuhi. Magatsuhi is the source of demonic powers. I think I don't know much about it. That was uh, no, Hellbox, right? I don't know much. Yeah, those are the Hellbox. Hellbox. I think I messed up the comma and the period there, but eh. Gah. Gah. Magatsuhi. Magatsuhi. It's locked from the other side. Okay. Well, we're not getting through there. Nope. I think maybe it's a trying a second time. Him. Oh, I think I, I remember how to get in there. Okay. So now we're going to go this way. And look! Fairy person! I've never seen a demon like you before! Are you looking for something too? 
Yes. N- no. Yes, we are. Okay. Hey, about that thing you're looking for. I'll help you if you want. I was looking for something, too. A demon who can help take me to Yogurt Park! You look kind of flabby and weak, but I'll let that slide. What do you say? Should we join up? No. Under no circumstances. Oh, dang it. <laughs> we actually need to. It's plot required. Fine. If we have the pass thingy, we can get through that door to the annex. I saw some Praetors carrying it. I'm Pixie the Fairy. I'm sure we'll be the best of friends. I have a dumb name. Well, as I explained in the previous video... Thanks, which... Pixie the Fairy. I'm Person the Human. Actually, you're not. Uh, no, we we are actually character. main character of the Fiend. Oh, the Fiend, yes. We are fiends, of, we are fiends because we are now demons. Oh, well, that's good. So Pixie is, in fact, a fairy. Um, she's level two. Oh, gosh, I... Didn't turn off my phone. Ah, ah, for shame! For shame! For shame! I'm terrible I certainly player. turned mine off before starting. No, you didn't. I'm certainly not turning it off right now. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, she's level 2, 36 hit points, 24 magic points. Uh, she is higher on the magic and luck than on the physical stats. Good to know. Uh, she resists electricity, so she takes half damage from electric attacks. But she's a flying type. No, she's a pixie. Um, she knows Dia, which is a healing spell, mm-hmm. and Zeo, which is a electric spell, which is probably why she resists electric. Good to know. And the next thing she's going to be learning is seduce. Well, um, now there is actually it's that kind of game. <laughs> I, uh, there is something good to know about this fairy mm-hmm. or pixie. Um, if you can keep this pixie all the way until the very end of the game. There's a room you can take her to, which will max out her stats. Spoilers! Eh, it's not that... It's This is this is less of a spoiler and more of a pro tip. Okay, well, what? Is, is, is there permadeath in here or something? No, well, um... You can, you can fuse her into a new monster. Oh. Or you can uh, get rid of her at Yoyogi Park. Gotcha. If you don't do either of those things... Okay. She will... We won't proud. fuse her, and we won't leave her at Yogurt Park. Yeah. Now, it's okay if she evolves, you just can't fuse her away. Right. So, you know. Got it. Pro tip. Yeah, use that right stick to look around. See the sky? It looks kind of different. A little bit. Those are just mountains. You know, all those mountains that have always been there. Uh, and she's in the party, right? So still used to always hitting triangle for uh, menus. Alright, so yeah. The first uh, three monsters you get will automatically go into your active party. Party! So, we're supposed to go find some prey Yeah. Magatsui! Magatsui! Ew, those gunky prey Oh, actually, you should be reading that. Ew! Oh, I forgot the that. Oh, it was kind of a sudden thing. Those gunky prey are inside! Yeah, let me talk to them in their napping native language. This has changed the tone of her voice. This is total racism right now. Me have Magatsuhi brought lots. Ga? That's me. Oh. Ga? Magatsuhi? Me eat, me eat. The door is now unlocked. Kick in the door! Kick in the door! <laughs> <laughs> You ready? Yeah. Blar ga magatsuhi. We don't have any magatsuhi to give the likes of you. If you don't want to get hurt, give us the pass thingy. <laughs> That's creepy. That is kind of creepy. Blar ga magatsuhi. Well. I think we're fighting. I think we're fighting. Me want to eat. Oh, goodness. Magatsuhi. Me eat. Alright, so let's try a lunge. Just for the sake of it. Yeah, lunge is 
Oh, he's dead! So it costs four hit points, but it does a lot of damage. Let's try Zeo. So because it's weak against it, um, it only used half an action, and thus we got to go again. Nice. And it looks like it stunned him, which is pretty awesome to me. When a monster stunned, all regular attacks will crit. Assuming they're uh, not immune to it. Good to know. Uh, Bagatsu He. Yeah, I think we could probably just beat it up now. Probably. Okay. We did it! We got 60 Hellbox. And 27 XP and a medicine. Oh man. A those creepy creatures were holding on to medicine. And a gate pass, apparently. Yep. You're stronger than I thought! But you can get even stronger if you talk to demons and get them on your side. We got the pass thingy, so let's head over to Yogurt Park! Stop calling it Yogurt! Well, I... I wasn't in the last session. I gotta make up for lost time. Oh, now if you look, uh, the compass is yellow, which means we are no longer safe. From now on, we can get into combat. Um, should we... Yeah, before we go over, let's go back down to the healing room, because we can. Demons are known for their wide elevators. It's true. So, yeah, basement no longer safe either. Uh, random encounter! Oh no, they attacked from behind. That's not good. Oh, it isn't. Alright, get him. Oh, that was enough to kill him, wasn't it? Nope. We got him poorly. It's okay. I mean, we're close enough to, uh... Oh! <laughs> okay. Wow, we were having the worst luck this round. Oh, but it happened back to them. Okay, let's lunge at you. No. Really? No more lunging, is that? Uh, <laughs> no, it's lunge. Thank you! <laughs> Finally. Nope! Wow. That's pretty awesome. Now. Oh no! Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, hunts and fowls are too dumb to actually be talked to. Oh, okay. Awesome. Level up. Leveled up. Let's get, you know, let's get some agility so we don't keep missing. <laughs> yeah. And we've learned Analyze. And Marogare wants to hopefully heal us again. Oh. Cool. Free strength up. That's awesome, Yay. too. <laughs> Check that out. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm now red and glowy instead of blue and glowy, and I'm it's cause you're dying limping horribly. around a bit. It's okay. Healing room's right there. Healing room, I believe, is... Nope, it's not safe, but... What do we want? Don't heal me! Yay, we're fully healed. And I'm pretty sure she's fully healed. Wait, too. eating them is an option? No. Well, it should be. But, you know, he's a ghost. He doesn't... He, he doesn't well, we wouldn't need better. him, but, like, everyone else should be fair. Ah! Oh, what's that? That is a Kodama. Like the things from Princess Mononoke. Okay. Oh, okay. And we can talk to it. Hey there! You wanna play? Um, um... Give me 30 Maka. Oh, sorry, it's not Maka. That's, that's Maka. That's, that's the name of the money. That's a much easier word to remember. Yes, it is. Uh, sure. Yeah. <laughs> that's still not enough. I want one medicine. Okay. Sh sure. Well, okay. Kodama seems to be satisfied. I'm Kodama the Jirei. Let's be friends. Oh man, it's even got a W in it. Kodama, hey, Kodama joined your party. Hooray! That is definitely hooray worthy. So we don't get any XP or Maka for it. But we have an extra party member. But we have an extra party member. That did not actually join the party. Okay, so... Okay. So only if it's through plot does it join, straight, straight away join your party. Plot rules! Kodama! Actually higher level than Pixie. <laughs> level, yep, level 3. Uh, so, 40 hit points, 21 magic points. Really agile. Pretty lucky. Uh, uh, resists force, weak against fire. 
because it's made of paper. Uh, yeah, that would seem... Uh, it knows Zahn, which is a force spell. And Gnection, which I don't remember what it does, so we'll take a look in the skills menu. And it will learn Dia, so I will have a second healer. Hooray! Hooray. Uh, skill menu. Kodama. Gnection. User becomes more persuasive with enemy of the same race. Huh. So, if we see any other Jirai... Sorry, Jirai. I, I, I used to call them Jirai before I actually knew how to pronounce Japanese words correctly. Oh, okay. And old habits die hard. That's true. So, a Jirai... Uh, you can pretty much uh, have a higher chance of successfully getting them to join your party. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I believe Seduce uh, is uh, masculine characters are more likely to be uh, to join a party but if she uh, does her thing. So, uh, Kodama's agility is high enough that he actually goes faster than everyone else. Um... Sure, let's try using Zon. Hacha! And because these things are uh, will wisps, they are weak against it. Cool. They're also, pretty weak. weak. Some punches. Uh, you know what? I think they're low enough with hit points that we can probably just beat them up. Hooray! And I'll know the lifestyle. And Pixie's gonna level up soon. Okay. Level up soon. Now that we have a part, a, a much bigger party, I think we should definitely save. Oh yeah. Hey, it's Hat Dude. He's still just contemplating the meaning of life over here. Apparently, it's forty-two. Oh, wow. Somebody should tell him. I remember what Magatsuki actually is. We'll find that out later as well. Ish. See, you should try and get out of the hospital. Yeah, that doesn't mean we're gonna get out of the hospital. But we should try. We might spend the entire game in this hospital. That's true. But it's actually not true. But it could be. It could be. In theory, it is possible that that is what this game is going to be. Spirit back there. <laughs> More will o okay. and another uh, paper guy. So, since... Do we not have good action? Should. Maybe, oh, maybe... Maybe, oh, maybe it's a passive. Uh, I think it's passive, yeah. Huh. It just means that I can... Oh, maybe he has to still have a... Uh, I don't know. It's been a long time. Now, so. We'll figure it out. So now, if I talk to this Kodama... Hey, that's my pal. Yeah, right, yeah. He needs to go home soon. Bye-bye. Oh. Yeah, you can, because you can only have one of any uh, monster. monster. If they see someone who is of the same type, they just leave. They might give you something occasionally. Yeah. That's pretty cool. So it's like, oh man, I'm low on hit points. I don't really want to do this fight. <laughs> Let's negotiate. Yeah, you can just talk to them out into leaving. Now, considering we actually need to level <laughs> up and still stuff. still one experience point away. Yeah. Because you don't get XP for them walk leaving. Right. So I probably should have just fought it, but I wanted to show off how that works. Good to know. I like that even though we seem to have lost our shirt with the becoming a demon process, we seem to have retained both pants and shoes. That's, uh, convenient, isn't it? Yes. And then possibly socks, but it's a little hard to tell. Okay. This, I think we can just... Take him down! Punch that paper guy! He got punched. Pixie leveled up! Yep. So, even though you can choose your own stat-ups, you can't choose the monster stat-ups, they choose it themselves. And oh. she now knows Seduce. Cool. Which does what? It does not open the map. We are going to be hitting that map many times. Okay, Pixie, Seduce. User recruits enemy to join your party. So this one specifically is a uh, an action. Okay. Connection, I guess. This, I guess he still needs a uh, an active ability. Mm. Okay. Use that gate pass. Cutscene of her opening the gate. It opened. Yep. There is a demon way stronger than you up in the annex. You'll probably die. Nice knowing you. Oh, well. Thanks. That must be the end boss. Oh, 
Oh. Oh no. It's another Prita. Kill Get it. Him. All the punches. Gotta love auto. It's faster. See that demon swimming around the lobby? Like he owns this place. What? That one. Oh, that one. <laughs> the one that's <laughs> literally right behind him. Yeah. That's Fornius. As long as he's here, it's not going to be easy to get out of this hospital. I don't know if you're familiar with who Fornius is. Nope. Fornius is one of the, I believe, Dukes of Hell, according to the, uh... Huh. Uh... Goetha? Goetha? Something like that. Something like that. Interesting. Hey there. Weird uh, thing. It's like an old woman that looks like a bit of a mop when... Yeah. From a distance. <laughs> I can see it! I can see you suffering in your battle against demons! But this future is only one of many possibilities! The future is not written in stone! In one of those futures, we went and got for I shall help you! What future do you desire? I want the one where we go get fruit frozen yogurt. So is that the bright future? That depends. I mean, you can get, like, chocolate frozen yogurt, which would Pick be a one. future. Um... Dark future? Hmm. Well, if you wish for a dark future, continue to use useless attacks, and your attacks shall be nullified, reflected, or absorbed. If you do all of this, a dark future full of defending shall await you. I shall help you. What future do you desire? Well, I guess we should check bright future then. Maybe. If you wish for a bright future, know your enemies and use attacks that they are weak against. If you do so, a bright future full of attacking shall await you. It's not easy to learn your enemy's weaknesses. Only through battle shall you gain knowledge. I shall help you. Okay, that's all. I shall wait here until you learn your future. <laughs> Alright, what was the point of that? Um, it was learning how, uh, it, was, it was kind of teaching you how combat works. Okay. Which reminds me, we have a new ability. We have Analyze, which will tell us huh. the monster's weaknesses, weaknesses. and strengths. Uh, that's useful. Unless you just want to punch him more. Which is sometimes be more effective. Aw, oh, better oh, she not no. I need that for vending. I, I don't think you do. Uh, did we go this No, we didn't. Is there anything in there? No, there isn't. Uh-oh. But we can see Fortius. Hello. Hey there, giant manta ray. Yep. I don't know where the lobby is full of water. Oh, it's the annex lobby. Yeah. It's different. It is. Uh, let's see what's in this room. Suspiciously like the non-annex lobby. Oh, hey, it's a thing. I have never seen a demon like you! Take this as a sign of our meeting. And we got a message. Rawr! Us demons have it rough. Rough. I like that guy. He's a pretty swell guy. I think we'll have to get one of him in my party at some point. I think he's a Shisa. Cash two! Nope. <sighs> Go ahead, Freda. Punch him! Ah! Oh, you're bad at punching. Okay. For a revival bead. Woo! Wanna guess what that does? Um. Revives people? Yep. Oh, man. Hey, you there! The demon next door isn't trying to eat me, is he? Wait a sec, you're a demon too! No, don't eat me! Which I still vote should be what we're doing with all these ghosts. I mean, hey, otherwise they're just like, gonna kick around this hospital forever. Some cash cubes down there. <laughs> down where? Show me, using the right stick. We'll need to find a way in there. We're out there. You could just punch through this glass. Apparently not. We're too cool for that. Punching is so last year. Oh. You're not trying to defeat Fornius, are you? Yes. Even if you're strong, you won't be able to beat him alone. 
Don't just beat all the demons. Try talking to them. Get them to join you. Oh. Or we could... Hey, you. Yay, tiny amounts of experience. <laughs> uh, that's where we came from, this way. Ooh, more life stones. I feel like they're trying to help us heal. Something like that. Mortius is strong and mean. I heard adults say demons are outside too. I want my mama. One day she'll come for me. I don't know how to tell you this, kid. Your mom's dead. Your mom's alive. Nice little courtyard over there. Yeah. And it's so apparently, water. yeah, surrounded by a moat, so we're going to have to find a very special way to get in there. Boats! Somewhere. Is it boats? Uh, it might be boats. Do you have time to spare? I guess. I saw a human sneak past Phonius just a while ago. Th thank you for that exceedingly important. This door will not open, probably because it's covered in couches. Yeah, I feel like we could move those couches, even punching demons, and we're clearly kind of strong. Kick, punch, it's all in the mind. More stairs! I'd be incredibly lost, I'm glad you're navigating here. Well, I mean, fortunately, yeah, there is the map, which I know, but the hallways are very samey. Now in the annex basement. Door! Uh, check out the door! Yeah, I can check out the door. More ghosts! Wormble. Demons stick together, so defeat the demons in the way first. They disrupt conversations. So, pretty much, if you're fighting a whole bunch of monsters and you want one of them to join your party, you yeah, should kill all the other ones first. Yeah. Mumble. There's a trick to negotiating with demons. Okay, what is it? <laughs> Mumble, there are some races of demons that rarely join through negotiation. Mumble. So that's pretty much haunts and fouls. I think there might be one other. Well, I think we all just learned a lot. <laughs> kind Isn't of that the way we came? That is where we came. Yeah, other way. Oh no! What do we do? Oh, wait, he's dead. I'm actually kind of pleasantly surprised that we're fighting a lot of single monsters. Yeah. Okay, let's first go this way. Because now we can unlock this door. Because it was locked on the other side. How'd we unlock? Oh, it was locked from this side. Yeah. Got it. Which means we can now run over this way. Heal and save. Heal and save. I kind of like when uh, games do that, yeah. where you can reach a, po a uh, healing and saving point that was much earlier from a late spot, Yep. and, and create a yeah. shortcut back to where you were. means it doesn't take as long to get back to where you were. Exactly. It's probably the only time in this game where we're going to get that. <laughs> the dungeons in this game will get very labyrinthine. Yeah, that's the right word. Yeah. It's nothing more fun than a labyrinth. You know what? I think we should call this a video. Okay. It's been about 30 minutes. All right. And then we will pick up from here when we get back. All right. Sounds good. All right. Have a good one, folks. See ya. Bye. I'm playing a game. <laughs>